When you think about your iPhone, it's probably the object that you use most in your life. It's, it's the product that you have with you all the time. With this unique relationship people have with their iPhone, we take changing it really seriously. We don't want to, to just make a new phone. We want to make a much better phone. iPhone 5 is the result of this approach. It's been completely redesigned. And for the first time ever, we've increased the size of the display. By making the screen taller but not wider, you can see more of your content but still comfortably use it with one hand. And yet, even with the larger display, iPhone 5 is the thinnest, lightest iPhone we've ever built. To achieve a design this thin, we had to look at making many of the components inside the design smaller. It's actually 18% thinner and 20% lighter than the previous iPhone. It took an incredible cross-collaborative effort to do this. From the beginning, we knew we wanted to bring LTE to the iPhone. What LTE does is it enables really fast downloads over your cellular network. You'll notice a big difference compared to previous network connectivity. In fact, LTE can actually be faster than the average Wi-Fi connection at home. The conventional approach of designing LTE into a world phone uses two chips. With a new iPhone, both voice and data technology are combined onto a single chip. This is one of the real breakthroughs that enables iPhone 5's thin design. We're also introducing an all-new Apple Design A6 chip. It delivers performance that's up to twice as fast as the previous generation. You'll experience a big increase in speed in everything you use your iPhone for, especially in the way it delivers more detail and boosts frame rates in graphics-intensive apps. The A6 chip is so power-efficient that it increases performance while also increasing its battery life. Given the dimensions of the new phone and all the capability that we wanted to add, we needed to manage space inside the phone very carefully. We've created the new, much smaller lightning connector. It's all digital, so it's designed for today's uses. And we made it reversible, so it fits either way. We also moved to a sapphire lens cover, which is thinner and more durable than the previous cover glass. This really protects the optics and keeps your photos looking great. I don't think the level of invention has ever been matched by any other product we've done. The seamless integration between hardware and software makes everything you do on iPhone 5 just feel more fluid, responsive, and fast. And with this amazing display, you just feel like you can do more. It's great for watching HD videos in full widescreen. And in portrait mode, iPhone 5 still fits so comfortably in your hand. Our all-new Maps application is fantastic. If you look at things like Flyover, it's a completely different experience than you've ever had before in Maps. And using turn-by-turn -turn spoken directions makes it really easy to get where you're going. Turn left onto Lombard Street. Then turn right onto Van Ness Avenue. The panorama feature is simply awesome. You can capture a panoramic photo just by moving your camera through the scene. Once you're done, the app combines what you capture into one beautiful panoramic shot. And now, Siri can do more for you. You can get sports scores and team schedules. Siri can also find places to eat and even help you make a reservation. Facebook is now integrated right into iOS 6, so you can post photos or share anything else you want to directly from your apps. And now, you can make a FaceTime call right over the cellular network, so no matter where you are, you're always able to see the ones you love. Along with the experience of actually using it, what makes iPhone 5 so unique is how it feels in your hand. The materials it's been made with, the, the remarkable precision with which it's been built. Never before have we built a product with this extraordinary level of fit and finish. We've developed manufacturing processes that are our most complex and ambitious. 
Starting with the aluminium, we machine all of the surfaces of the enclosure. We then polish and texture them. We then use crystalline diamonds to cut the chamfers. It's so